Welcome to the awesome. I am Big Roy, and this is Marvel Strike Force. So at the beginning of this raid season, the top players in my old alliance, the Sigma Kraken Hunters, joined forces with the top players of Sigma Alpha to create a Superstar Alliance. And in this Superstar Alliance is none other than the man of legend himself, Seton. I'm sure most or all of you probably already watch his stuff, but just in case you don't, make sure you go and check him out. He also makes awesome content. Now, we just so happen to run the same cosmic lane in the raid, so let's see where Big Roy is at. I am two nodes away from the boss. You can see my awesome alliance leader, Darth Longstride, hitting that boss right now as we speak. Now, let's see where Seton's at. He is also two nodes away from the boss. So you can see that if you're dedicated enough as a free-to-play player, you can still be competitive with beta players that have spent some money on the game. Now, my roster will never be anywhere near as good as his, but as long as you focus on the strongest characters and don't get sidetracked too much, you can still do very well in raids and other areas of the game. Now you may be thinking, Big Roy, why is your score not up there with Seton? Well, my boy Fat Honey Badger did take some of my early cosmic nodes because I wasn't awake when the raid started. That's okay, I ain't mad at you, you're still my hero. He did help us get over the 60% hump when he joined us early on to get the alpha raids down. This is the last strike raid alpha. We don't know if it's going to come back, or if it does come back, or it will come back in this form, so we'll see. If it does come back in the same form, I hope they buff Groot or get a good cosmic healer. On to the best news in a long time, for me at least. Rocket Raccoon is now in the raid store that just hit. I've been looking forward to this because I want to get him to six stars so I can get my Star-Lord to six stars. So I don't have to farm one of those crappy Ravagers. <laughs> Rocket Raccoon is an amazing character. I love him even more than Crossbones now. So I can't wait to get him to seven stars. I'm going all in on him. I've saved up a lot of raid credits, just about 22k I think, and eight raid orbs. So let's open those up, see if I can get some of him. He is 10% drop because there are now 10 raid characters in there so let's see how we go all right we got two come on we need some fives nope all right i need some of that chew burger luck nope not there either chew burger is my uh for those that don't know he's my co-host on the marvel strike force or no just strike force masses of launch podcast and he is the luckiest person i know he pulls millions regularly from the gold orbs Ooh, another two all right and he's pulled tons of black widow so his black widow is six stars so i need some of his luck and it doesn't look like i'm gonna get it i'm getting some of the kree oracle so maybe i can do some fury action i guess so I guess I need to get around to doing that, because that is the most overpowered team. We talked about that and the hackers in Dark Dimension, the data mine stuff, and a whole lot of other fun stuff in the latest podcast episode, so check that out. Link is in the description. And until next time, stay tuned and stay awesome.